Okay, so we're going to be looking at um, creating a game on GimKit. So to start off with, you're going to go to this little blue button here. You click on New Kit. We're going to do Taylor Swift Fun, Subject Other, go to Next. We're going to use the confetti because I feel like that's fun and whimsical. Then we're going to go, then it automatically takes me here. So the first thing I want to show you how to do is to create with flashcards. And so if I want to say import flashcards, typically this is the one that you would choose because you might want to import flashcards from, let's say Quizlet. So if I'm on a Quizlet, Taylor Swift song lyrics, <laughs> I'm going to go down to this little three, these three dots. I'm going to click on export. When I click on export, you're going to see this, um, all, all this content here. Well, I'm going to just tell it to copy the text. I'm going to tell it to copy the text and then I'm going to paste it into the import set. And now I have questions with four answer choices. Easy peasy. Another way you can do it is you can insert your own individual questions. When you insert your own individual questions, you can say something like, what state was Taylor Swift born in? Pennsylvania, Tennessee, Nashville, Texas, or Tennessee, Texas, uh, New York. Um, she was born in PA. That answer is correct. Now, if I, there are multiple correct answers, I can select multiple correct answers as well. So another thing you could do is instead of just having that question, you could do it to where you say, add question, um, and a song, Daylight, Swift, it says she once named love was burning bread, but now realizes it's and instead, what if I don't want to have an answer if I want to add a photo? I can add a photo, and the answer is, she says it's golden. Um, let's say I just want to have pictures here, so I'm going to pick some fun pictures. Um, green. And the last one we're going to say, um, gray. And so they get to pick an answer using pictures, which I think is kind of cool. Um, you can also insert questions from a bank. So you say add questions from bank. If I search kids and say Taylor Swift, and there's all these questions that are gonna pop up. And I can pick any of the questions. I can tell to add all the questions. I can pick one, two maybe, and then I can leave. And those questions I see here, here. Hope that was helpful. Hope you learned a little something about how to create a game.